Anyways, without further ado, let's spin! Journey to Silius. I genuinely don't know what that game is. I'm gonna have to look up that game again. I think it's one of those games on the Nintendo Switch Online. Uh, yeah, it's an NES game on Switch Online. Okay, here it is. Journey to Silius. Jay is on a mission to take down an army of mechanical terrorists responsible for his father's death. This sounds familiar. Along the way, he must face five stages in order to complete his father's hope of developing a space colony in the Cilius solar system. The key to victory will be selecting the right weapon for the situation. Open the weapons screen with the start button or switch weapons with the select button? Weapons other than the handgun consume weapon energy to use, so be careful. More weapons can be found as the story progresses, and along with those additional weapons, battle options will open up as well. Oh, so it's a it's a Galaga clone, then, from the sound of it. Oh, it's made by Sunsoft! Oh! I know that. I know that company. Cool. Alright. Let's see what this game's all about. Hey, Nintendo Addict, how's it going? Sounds a bit like Blaster Master. Is that like Math Blaster? After many years of space colony development, Jay's father has passed away. The evening news reported that Jay's father's death was an accident. Yeah, right! Several days later, Jay finds a floppy disk left in his father's room. Oh yeah, A.T. I remember that guy. He made one of those infamous Lemmings levels. I hear the terrorists are planning against... <laughs> oh, it's one of those games. With, with the trans... I hear the terrorists are. You must complete my mission if I cannot. This game is related to Blaster Master. Okay, never played Blaster Master. Ugh, they will pay the price for the death of my father. Yeah, they will. Stage one. Rest three. Okay. Okay. Oh, it plays kind of similar to Mega Man. Alright, I can get behind this. Oh, I almost just ran headlong into a bullet. Oh yeah, this plays very similar to Mega Man. Okay. You cannot control your momentum when you're in midair, so we gotta watch out for that. Oh. Oh, that's cool. You can crouch to sh Oh, that's not fair. Wow. Okay, I'm still working out the controls. Apparently, there's frequent checkpoints, though, because, like, this is different from the stuff I played earlier. Oh, I thought that was, like, a platform I could jump up to. That would have been nifty. Uh-oh. I'm failing on stage one of Blaster Master. Or, I'm sorry. Journey to Silius, or whatever it is. Oh, thank goodness, I had found some health. I revenge my father! Yeah, I, I have a feeling, I don't think you will. I'm, j I'm just pointing that out there. He's, this guy's probably not going to avenge his father. Oh, hey, it's a boss time, maybe. Oh, we died. Game over already! Whoopee! Oh, do we want to end, or can- Obviously, we're going to continue. Probably have to start the whole stage again. Yeah. That's okay. I was getting used to the controls first time, so first first try is just the warm-up. How's it going, Eddie? Uh, we're playing NES shoot-em-up games right now. Oh, yeah. You cannot change the direction of your air momentum after you jump. It's like SNES Donkey Kong Country. 
Dane, nice shot, bro. With your homing missiles. Oh. No, oh, I stubbed my toe on the landmine. What would my dad say about that? Nothing. He's dead. Oh! Also, you can't scroll the enemies off screen in this game like you can in Mega Man. It's the lamer Mega Man. Sorry, folks, but when it comes to shooters, Mega Man, or when it comes to 2D platformer shooters, Mega Man's where it's at. Ow, my butt! Oh no, should have ducked. Game's being pretty plentiful with the uh, checkpoints, though. Do we get his weapon? Uh. That was weird. Oh! I kept pushing the pause button, that's what was going on. What weapons do we have? Uh, handgun. Yeah, but like, how do I change to the other guns? Machine gun? Shotgun. Let's go machine gun. That sounds fun. Ouch. Okay. Maybe. Let's try the shotgun. Ouch! I'm very bad at this. <laughs> okay, let's try the handgun. It's good old reliable. I think the G is my, like, special weapon gauge, so, like, every time you fire the shotgun, I think it depletes some of the ammo. Yeah, how do you like that, Mr. Helichopter? Oh, great. I have to hit its weak spots. The helicopter could literally just deck me right now, and I would not be able to avoid it. jump button is not super responsive. Oh, I, I defeated it, apparently. Good job! You'll avenge your father yet! Maybe. This, there seems to be a, a decent variety of NES games about characters that have to avenge their father. Looking at you, Ninja Gaiden. Ninja Gaiden's fun, but man, it's just stupidly difficult. <sighs> Do -do -do -do. Okay! That's a scary enemy. These guys don't seem to do much. Okay. The arm guys, I guess, get right underneath them. Ooh. Ha-ha! In your face! Oh, I just completely skipped the ladder. Ouch! Ow. <laughs> this level's a little... Come off it! Nah!
smart enough to react to that one. Alright, Artie, all those all those years of playing Mega Man. Oh, I died. Never mind. Game over. Yeah, I have a feeling we're gonna be seeing that one a couple times. <laughs> Gotta continue. It said there were five stages, so Maybe it'll be like Kirby's Dreamland and we can get through all of them. Give me a break, it's an NES game. And I've never played it before. If you have a, if you have a game that's so small, like, if you've got a system that's so limited you can only make a game that has five levels in it, you gotta make sure that your people play it for a long time, and one way of doing that is to make the levels really difficult. So you gotta practice them. Also, I probably should use the other weapons a bit more. I'm pretty much just using my main weapon. Which probably isn't the ideal one to be using for most of these situations. But it's the default, and so I love it. That is, that is surprisingly nice of the game to not force me to do stage one again. Yeah. Darn! I pro... That tank is tough, man. Elevator. I can't move while I'm on the elevator. There you go. Oh, yeah. This ain't going... Oh, no. I have to fight the tank again? Why? Guess the checkpoints aren't that generous. Ow, my toe. Hey. Darn it. Oh, I'm really bad at this. I'll give, it, I'll give it one more go, and then I honestly... <laughs> honestly, I might just move on to the next game, because I feel like this is giving us a good idea of what the game is like, and if there are only five stages, then I'm actually exploring a pretty sizable amount of the game already. The, again, it's roughly a half hour of each game, but NES games that are small, I might play for less of a period of time. And others, like Earthbound Beginnings, I might play for more of a period of time. Okay, this time I'm going to use the machine gun against the tank, and I think that'll help make some difference. Yeah, why don't leak your face? Hey, how's it going, X-Dude? Oh, shoot. Forgot, I forgot to update. You know, it's too late to update Twitch now for what game I'm playing. I'm, pl I'm playing Avenge Our Space Fobber. Because that is what we're doing, essentially. Okay. Machine gun time. But I didn't do a whole lot of good. No, not the shotgun. The handgun. Oh, the first one of those guys didn't spawn in. That's interesting. Now we machine gun. And there we go. That was a lot easier. Ah. Ouch. Thanks for the health. I really appreciate that, man. Let's go. Uh-oh. 
I don't like that enemy. It sure would be nice if there was a j uh, run button. Let's break out the shotgun for this one. Oh, I love game lag. Oh, I really love game lag when... Wow. Here's the thing. When the game lags, oftentimes when you push a button, it doesn't do anything. Because it has to render all the graphics on screen. It doesn't have time to process other intensive things like, you know, what buttons you press. Okay. Do not let these alien guys stay on screen for long. Wow, they hurt a lot, though. Weak to the machine gun, though. Ouch. How the heck are you supposed to avoid that guy's attacks? Well, I beat him! Hey! Oh, now we have the real boss, though. That looks like Wily Machine 2 to me. Game over. So if I start over, is it going to put me at the start of Stage 2 or at the start of that boss? Probably the start of Stage 2, I would assume. Never mind, I ran out of continues. So now if I want to play, I have to start over again. Well, <laughs> no, I, I don't think so. I, I think that's enough of Journey to Silius. But, but that was interesting, that's for sure. That was an interesting game. I can see why it was uh, put on the S Switch Online, because that seems like a pretty solid NES game. Just very difficult. No doubt there. Uh... Yeah. Well... There, there we go, folks. That was Journey to Silius, and if you have a Nintendo Switch NES Online, you can play it too.